Bedard Bonanza 2.0. We got five Bedard boxes to rip. And some of you have the opportunity to hit Bedard rookies right now. Hope everyone's having a great week leading into Saturday's National Hockey Card Day. Make sure if you are able, if you're in the area, come by the shop. I'm going to be there till about 1 or 2 o'clock from about 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. Doors open at 11. Lineup is going to be early, but I'll keep you guys entertained. Don't you worry. I'll be doing surprises outside throughout, and I'll be doing surprises. All you got to do is sign up. Uh, not sign up, for example, if you're already here. But if you aren't, I will show you a QR code. All you got to do is scan it, enter your email, enter your YouTube name, and enter your name on Facebook. And you are entered for three different prizes. I'm going to do a different prize for each one. So you put your email in, you're entered for one prize. YouTube's another, and Facebook is another one. So three prizes getting given away. Also, if you come to the shop, you get a free pack of cards just by walking in the door. And how you can get more is... You spend 25 bucks in store on any Upper Deck product, you get five more packs plus the 31st bonus card, which I think you can imagine who that might be. A big rookie for the Hawks, Bedard. And you spend 50 bucks, you get to pop a balloon in store. You can win things from framed photos, autograph memorabilia, autograph jerseys, hobby boxes, and a ton more. So make sure to come by the shop and I actually I don't know what the limit on balloons is, but uh, you spend 50 bucks, you get one balloon. So you keep spending 50 bucks, you get more balloons. There must there's some sort of limit I remember, but uh, can't remember at the at this moment. But make sure to come by the shop. Make sure to come early, and I'll be doing prizes outside as well. I'll be giving away free cards to the kids as well. So if you got some kids looking for some base cards, I'll have a bunch at my table outside. So make sure the first 150 for the door prize and a free coffee from McDonald's or small fries if you're feeling hungry for some fries in the morning. Also, don't think I forgot about all of you, part of our Facebook group that aren't in Edmonton. I will be doing a contest on the Facebook group. I'm probably going to do a big break on Saturday as well. I'll keep you guys updated. I might move it to Sunday just with all the craziness of Saturday, but I'm going to be doing something big and I will post that link into, uh, I will post a separate link into the Facebook where people on Facebook can enter. I mean, you could, if you go in store and you enter all three of those, plus you get on the Facebook, that's four giveaways that you got, uh, got a chance in. All right, let's do it. Without further ado, uh, Pasco telling us to hurry up. It's late on the East Coast. <laughs> hey, we got a Starbucks. Look at this. We got one. I saved a little bit for this one. Awesome, Anthony. Hey. We, I love the support either way. I, you guys don't have to ever buy into a break. Just hang out with us when we're ripping cards. Have some fun. It's so entertaining to have so many of you along for this ride. And Anthony, I'll be looking to hit you some big cards with some first-timer luck. And thank you for the segue. First-timers today. We got Ted. We have Brett. And we have those two. Two newbies today. Chino making an appearance again with us. So is Ashton. What's going on? Gary, Ed. How's it going, everyone? Good luck. Ted's got Anaheim. Brett has Nashville. If you're part of the live right now, speaking of contests, all you got to do is comment any NHL team right now in the comment section on YouTube or Facebook, and you're entered to win 10 bucks if that team hits the lowest number card in today's break. All right. Without further ado, let's do... All right, let's do... Uh, I, I like doing this one first. Oh, there we go. I thought it was going to all fall over. I was having a hard time before this getting everything to stay standing up. So we'll see how it goes. 62, 11, 12, Rookie Anthology. Let's do it. Let's do it. Here we go. Bonus pack. All these ones. 62. So if you come by the shop, you got a lot of contests to get into. And I'm going to be doing some interactive stuff with people in line. I'm just going to pick randomly people. Maybe do some interviews. Uh, I'm also going to do some giveaways for the kids uh, and anybody doing the interviews. So it doesn't matter if you're 95 or 5 years old. I could call on you for some of the content I'm filming for YouTube. So if I call on you or I come up to you and ask, uh, if you don't want to be filmed, trust me, no worries. Um, we, can, we can definitely uh, bypass that. But uh, if you do, 
Uh, we will get you. Oh, look at this. This just died. Nice. Our light has died immediately. But uh, if you do want to get filmed, you'll be featured in our YouTube, which is now over. 1,000 members, and you will also be featured most likely on our TikTok as well. So if you want to be part of it, let me know. I will be going through the line, calling out people. And uh, I know some people ask for autographs, pictures, and everything like that. Absolutely never a worry about that stuff. So if you do, then uh, then definitely let me know. I can definitely do that. Rookie Rivalry, Zach Cassian, Aaron Palushai. I had a few Palushai cards back in the day. He uh, obviously did not pan out, but uh, I thought he was going to be good. Montreal and Buffalo. So Buffalo is Paul Montreal. Ed. Pasco is going to chirp my uh, French accent there. Yeah, need an assistant? Should just drop dump Colby off. I uh, I roped in the sister and uh, and the mom, but uh, I'll have to use Colby in the future. Trust me, we'll get we'll get Colby involved in something uh, in the future that I'm doing. I wish I was going to the card show in May, but uh, unfortunately we're on vacation for that time frame. But uh, I would have got him to help me out. Rookie rivalry. Look at that. Aaron Palushai times two. Jake Gardner on the left. Palushai on the right again. Where's the address of the shop on the website? Uh, is it not on the website? If you Google Wayne Sports Cards, it'll, it'll pop up though. Very good accent. Look at that. Pasco, that's the stamp of approval right there. That's the stamp of approval. All right. I, I haven't looked at the uh, the YouTube in a sec. Let me give me one moment. I'll, I'll jump on there. See what see what we're talking about. Carl Sneep, rookie for the Pens. Great time to look at the YouTube. Big McDavid in '99. Yes. Uh, this does not go in this. Actually, whatever. We'll just put it in there. Carl Sneep for Pittsburgh. Bring your thick boy memberships. Yeah, you better. Thick Boy Club always engaged with the lava hands. Yes. 1,000%. 1,000%. I might. I'm working on getting one of the merch items for the Edmonton card show. I will only have them at the card show. It'll be a limited stock. The first run of our first merch. Um, so uh, I will let you guys know if it's there. Cody Eakin, Washington. I'm, gonna, I'm trying hard to get it there in time. So uh, don't worry. We'll try. Washington, Cody Eakin. Yes, enter the contest. You still have a little bit to go. We have not hit a number card yet. So if you have not entered the contest, all you got to do is say any team name in the comment section right now. Matt Fraser, Dallas Stars. Awesome. Awesome, Pasco. Yeah, definitely. If you guys are ever coming by the shop, tell them, tell them, uh, tell them you heard from it through the breaks. They, do, they love it. They love hearing about all of us. Coming in here about the shop through the different channels. Rookie Anders Nielsen, New York Islanders, Anders Nielsen. Yes, some people jumped in the contest late. I love it. Get in there. No numbered card yet. Ooh, this one feels thick. We might have our numbered card. All right, we're getting a numbered card. Get in there. Get in the contest. Hurry. All right, here we go. Felt like three cards there. Weird. All right, let's see what we got. Here we go. Rookie, it's the Maple Leafs. Joe Colburn. Not the biggest of cards. <laughs> Joe Colburn, that is our first numbered hit of the day. So our contest is now closed. Closed on Paul on YouTube with Buffalo. And closed. Actually, we'll put uh, Punisher88 in there. Kings, you're good. And Ted on Facebook with Canucks. What's going on, Ted? Welcome to the breaks, Ted. Good luck today. We shouted you out at the start. If you missed it, roll back to the start. We gave you some horns for the first time. Good luck today, Ted. Hoping to hit some magic for you. Andy Mille. That's a cool last name. Out of $9.99. Arizona. Two packs left plus our bonus pack that 1112 is known for. Hopefully a patch auto in that one or something. Auto rookie David Savard. Not too shabby. We know him. Colburn, probably a lot less known, but uh, he's on there. I think these were numbered. Yeah, 44 out of 299. David Savard. Hey, not bad. It's better than a kick in the nuts, I say. It's better than that. Doug says Leaf's going to hold the 499. Well, you just got tied with Columbus there. All right, let's see what we got. 
We have a Carl Hagelin, Rangers. Hey, not bad. Sometimes you'll get those uh, decent rookies, sometimes not. Landis Nuge, again, the uh, top guys we're chasing in this stuff. All right, let's see what we got. We've had some good luck with these bonus packs lately. Never heard of Leafs Colburn gets the gold for three seconds. Yeah, Col I, I remember Colburn from uh, playing in the AJHL actually a long, long time ago. <gasps> oh, what a hit! Bucks number one! Flyers, Jeremy Yager, your stick and jersey as we get the horns going. There you go, Flyers, nice hit. That one going out to Ed. Ed Bryanton, nice hit. Nice hit. Luxury suite stick and jersey. That is nasty. Yager, that's going to stay center stage for quite some time into this one. I can tell you that. Yager for the Flyers. No numbering on these bonus packs, but these are very hard to hit for those big guys. Nice one there. Confused on the Hawks uh, giveaway. How did that work? So the Hawks giveaway, we left Hawks out of the regular team random. And then the top six people, each one Hawks, for either one box or the whole break. So, I'll go through just so everybody knows. Rob is going to have the Hawks for this box. Daniel's going to have them for this box. Lyndon's going to have them for S one SP game used. Lynn is going to have them for one SP game used. Ted is going to have them for artifacts. And Aaron has Hawks for any other box. That's how we did that one. Alright. Let's do it. Speaking, let's just go into it. Why not just pull the Bedard right here? 80 on the box. So this is Linden. So Linden has the opportunity at a Bedard right here, right now. Did Pittsburgh lose today? Oh, no way. Yeah, that's taking the cake early. That's taking the cake early. Why did this open so weird? Anyways. Oh, we opened it from the wrong end. This would have been a lot quicker. There you go. 80 on the box. Thanks for the contest cards. Black and white cameras, Vest Legends, and the Young Guns Kessel Ring showed up the other day. You are very welcome. And uh, a great segue into what I'm about to say. I do box reviews on every single new release for the hockey. I just miss SP Game Use, but I posted a different thing for you guys. I will post one every single time, and we give away some of the cards that we hit in those boxes, and you can win. All you gotta do is comment on the uh, video, and make sure you're subscribed, and that's all it takes to win. And Dags won a couple cards. Pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. Gold. Rob Blake get a 188. Rob Blake for the LA Kings. We're still looking for Anaheim and Nashville for our uh, newbies today. Anaheim and Nashville. Rookie sweater. Toronto. Toronto getting on the board a few times here early on. Just don't get the seven results. Just wondered how the one. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's how it goes. Top six. Top six. To the back, Mario Ferrero, Global Series from the Czech Republic. We've reached international levels now with this group. We did have a supporter all the way from Czech. Aiden McDonough, 112 out of 250. And he, actually, i got to tell this story because it's crazy. He messaged me that uh, he uh, bought some packs of Series 2. He had two sealed, and uh, I believe he hit Bedard in one. And do you hit another Bernard or just in one? I can't remember. I can't remember. All right, to the back. Ooh, Anaheim for our newbie Ted. John Gibson. Auto, that's a great first card to hit. John Gibson, one of the best goalies in the game. There you go. Anaheim. Boom, John Gibson. There you are. All right, Linden, here's your chance for Bedard. Let's see if we can do it. Good luck, Linden. Good luck, deep cuts. Oh, I thought it was. There is a Canada Bedard. This is not too shabby. Adam Fantilli Columbus. 97 out of 250. Very nice. There you go. Columbus. Very sweet. Ted's liking his first hit. I'm liking it too. That's sweet. All right, let's do something like this. We'll move the double jersey to the back. 
There you go. All right, Linden off the board with the Bernard chance. Pizzer won an OT, 6-5? Oh, you meant that it was in a Flyers uni. Yeah, you know, you'd usually see him in the Pittsburgh, I agree. All right, let's go Trilogy next. I don't have to stand up. I don't know why I stood up just to grab that. Results round number four I had first. Ooh, yeah, th that's the painful part is looking at the uh, the uh, the other rolls and not the uh, final results. I do that sometimes, and I'm like, oh, I would have had first, or I would have had Bedard. But, uh, yeah, just the final results count, and then it's just the top, uh, the top six, at least for this one. We do give away the Oilers sometimes. That would go to the top spot. So, yeah, just keep an eye out for those ones. I like to toss in some of those free ones. Eichel base. Go to the back. We got Byfield base. Our red. Elmer Soderblom. Level 1. 299 red. And William Eklund for San Jose. 70 out of 75. Nice hit for the Sharks. Going out to Riley. William Eklund. The future. We'll throw him right on the end there. Slide Rob Blake to the back. Soderblom is going to go up as well. Put him in front of Hagelin here. There you are. Gibson pops up in a lot of packs. Yeah, he does actually. Dexos, let's get some lava hands going. You know it. We got some already. Did you see this one? The Yager stick jersey. Crazy. Crazy. All right. Let's go to the back. We got another base to the very back. 799, Thomas Bordalo. And we have... Rookie Premier's Auto, Jacob Perot. The Anaheim Ducks with their second auto of the day. I just noticed a little bit of damage at the top there. You guys can probably see that. But Ted, two autos for you. Let me know if you want to get this one replaced. We do, uh, we do deal with Upper Deck on your behalf to replace any damaged cards. So there's still quite a few we have dealing with Upper Deck. Um, but we are getting them through. So if you have a damaged card, just know I write a sticky note. I write your name, the break, everything. So you'll get sent a card at a later date. Upper Deck does take a little bit of time to uh, take these in and send replacements. But uh, they do replace damaged cards. 142 out of 449. Some of the older stuff we open, like the 1112, the damaged cards won't get replaced for that kind of stuff just because they're so old. But uh, any of this stuff from recent years definitely will. All right. Uh... Ted, I'm going to write your name down in here just in case. Uh, I, I would get that one replaced just because uh, it is it is a good amount of damage. So we'll make sure to get that replaced for you. If not, though, uh, some people just want to keep the cards. And that's, by all means, uh, definitely, definitely, definitely acceptable. All right. But for now, we're going to put it up on display because it's a nice card. It's an auto. Yeah, they are slow, I will tell you. They are slow at sending replacements, but uh, they come eventually. They come eventually. <laughs> All right, auto. We're going to move Fantilli. I know it's weird. We're moving Fantilli to put up an auto, but I think it's necessary. We'll do that, and uh, we'll move the rookie rivalry there. All right. Bordelow, Sharks. Crosby had a goal and two assists. Wow, that's actually awesome. I love that. I love seeing Crosby succeed. Such a great player. Stutzla, Generations Future. And Kent Johnson, nice one for Columbus there. That'll go well with your Fantilli on the side. Kent Johnson, Columbus Blue Jackets, seven ninety nine on that one. Uh, covering up Rob Blake, it seems weird, but uh, we'll do it for now. Nikito Kyodiak, New Jersey trilogy renditions, nine ninety nine. Marco Rossi, level one. There we go, Minnesota. One of the rookies we're after. We're going to cover up our other rookie rivalry in the back. Nikita Okyodiuk, New Jersey rookie. Two backs left. Still looking for our relic, I believe. Alex Newhook, Future Generations. Nikita Okyodiuk, level 1 at a 999. 126 out of 999 on that one. New Jersey Devils. Just resorting where I'm putting these cards underneath here. There we go. All right, Alex Newhook, rookie. Waiting on a replacement for Artifacts. Nice double patch auto out of five. When did you send that in? Curious. How long has it been? I know sometimes they take a couple weeks. Or, sorry. Takes a couple weeks sometimes for it to arrive, even. And then uh, I've seen it take quite some time to get back. All right, Relic coming up. Braden Schneider at a 699 level two. Hey! Seattle! 
Shane Wright, 154 out of 499. He's looking like he might be a uh, decent player coming up. He might be a decent NHLer. We'll have to wait and see. The jury is still out on him. So we'll see how that shakes out. Before Christmas. Yeah, I've seen replacements take like four, five, six months before. Painful, but uh, they do they do make it right. I will say that. Upper Deck is really good at replacements. A lot of other um, card companies don't even do replacements. His hard push this year makes me think he's done. Yeah, I kind of I kind of get that. That does make sense. I think he might have um I, I think he might play for a couple more years. 30 on the box. I think he might have a couple more years in him, but uh it is it is interesting. It's the end of an era for sure. Cujo in a Leafs jersey, please. Hold your goalies. Doug, let's do it. Cujo in a Leafs. You got a chance, I believe, in uh, in metal. He's been. I don't know if he's in that specific checklist. I I haven't seen his specific name. If he is or isn't, he might be. Um, I don't know for sure. Ooh, we might have a nice one on our hands here. You know the drill. Get out your thick boy memberships. Let's go. All right, let's get the fire going. I think we got something. Let's get the fire popping. All right, rookies. Well, it's not Cujo, but it is Cujo's the next Cujo. Eric Schalgren, 201 at a 299. Matthews scored two tonight. No way. I would love to see Matthews get to 70. That'd be so cool. I want to see Kucherov get 100. I want to see McDavid get 100. Will they give me same value card? You think value based on what? Uh, they give you approximate, approximately the same. Uh, it's They can never really get it the exact same, but... Uh, they check Beckett pricing, the old price guide, and then they check uh, current sales. Um, sometimes there's some subjectivity in there as well. They'll try to send you something similar. You won't, you, I've never gotten the same card back unless it's a young gun, just for reference. All right, Radiance FX, 71 out of 5 of 49. That's why uh, sometimes I do keep damaged cards. Um, depends on the card. Um, for big stuff or low numbered stuff, I sometimes might. Uh, it just depends on the, uh, the, the, Depends on the extent of the damage because you shouldn't get damaged cards, so they'll definitely replace them. Michael Isimo at Winnipeg, 47 out of 199. Did we get a Nashville hit and did I skip over it? Why am I thinking we had some Nashville? No, not yet. All right. We're still hoping for one for our guy, Brett. Let's hit Brett. A nice card. Yeah, definitely let me know. I always love hearing about that kind of stuff. So if you guys ever uh, pull a big card, redemption, etc., let me know. I'm always curious. Always curious. All right. Pittsburgh. Val Terry Boosting in at a 499. Obsidian rookies. You all are going to love the next card. It is this exact card. This black. With a silver or gold auto. Let's see what it is. Which way is it going? It should be a patch auto too. Come on. Be a big boy. Come on. We got the fire going. Black. Lustrous. I don't want 25! Chase Pearson. Detroit, not the biggest of guys we're looking for, but a nice one. Going to Riley. Nice hit there. Chase Pearson, almost a two color. You can barely see it there. I'm sure you guys can see that little bit of red, but we'll call it one color with a seam for now. But look how nice those silver on black autos look. So nice. Oh, I love these cards. Anytime when they put the silver on black or gold on black, the cards just pop so nicely. All right, we're going to move Chase Pearson to the silver. Of course, the silver auto. And we're going to slide this guy here and our auto in the back. We're going to put him right there. All right. Oh, Michael, that's unreal. Michael got back his stature auto redemption in from Upper Deck today. That's unreal. Michael, you got to share that with me. Send me a picture of that. That's, that's awesome. All right, let's see what we open next. Let's go clear cut. Might as well. We'll go clear cut. So, Aaron, you have the Hawks for all the other boxes, my friend. So, there is a Bedard that you could potentially hit in here. It'd be nice if you could input it and they'd tell you before you send what they'd send in replacement. Then you could make that choice. Oh, that's, that's a good point. That is a good point. I don't know if they're uh, that quick at it, though, because... 
I mean, it is a good point. They should do something like that, or at least uh, at least some sort of range. Ooh, exclusive at a 35. Come on. Oh, Peter Forsberg, six out of 35. Speaking of Michael with bangers, Forsberg at a 35. Exclusives auto. Let's go, Michael. That's a beauty right there. Nice hit. Nice hit. Look at that. I think that's going to take off our Yager from the gold. I thought Yager was going to be up there for forever, but uh, it looks like he got kicked off for now. All right, we're going to keep Gibson and Pearson on the bronze for now if they play nice. For now, they are. Nice hit. Kian, what's going on, Kian? What's going on? Yeah, Shalgren is a definitely a hold your goalie candidate. He is 100% a hold your goalie candidate. 25 on the box. Toronto always has wishy-washy goalies. So any goalie that can come up and be be a good goalie, that's big time. It's similar. The Maple Leafs need a Stuart Skinner situation. They've been looking for a goalie for forever. They get a guy that they've been in their system, comes up, and he becomes the starter. That's what they need. I'm pretty sure in that box there was just a piece of uh, like a gum foil. Anyways, Mike Michael said he's having a good day. Crosby Redemption comes in, Islanders win, and you hit a nice one there in the Forsberg. That's awesome, Michael. Well, let's continue it. All right, artifacts, Ted. Ted, this is your chance at the Hawks, and more specifically, Mr. Bedard. So good luck. We have Tage Thompson out of 299. Buffalo Sabres. Tage Thompson. Good luck, Ted. I'm, I'm pulling for you. I am pulling for you hard here. I hope it happens. Come on, baby. Come on. We got our crystallized or our clear cut hit here. Could be Bedard. It is Jackson Lacombe. Anaheim having a good day today. Ted, it's it happens every time. Whenever anybody has the team, the giveaway team like the Hawks, they always hit their own team. I don't know what the hockey card gods are doing with this stuff, but it seems to happen quite often. Jackson Lacombe, nice one for the Ducks. Throw that in the back. That's a cool card. Beauty, great player Forsberg is. Yeah, I agree. I agree. All right, four ninety nine. Dawson Mercer, the red matching there. Nice hit, Dawson Mercer, New Jersey Devils. Come on, Bedard. Come on, big redemption. All right, we got a jersey. It looks like. Let's see, what we got. Ooh, at a ninety nine. Oh my. Okay, let's see, what we got. Come on, goalie. Slam Ascara Brett, what a first hit! The beginner's luck! Let's go! 24 out of 99. Brett, nice hit! The first timer is killing it today. Congratulations, there is a mark on this one. I'm gonna throw this one out. And we'll put a new one on there. Look at that. Askarov, he is a fantastic, fantastic goalie. He's going to be the Nashville goalie of the future. He's got a little guy named UC Soros in his way, though. Yeah, what a great first hit. Brett, welcome to the group, my man. Welcome to the group. Let's give you some horns there. And that's going to kick off a couple other ones today. And we are going to do something like that at the moment. These guys are going to boot Fantilli and Savard. We're going to do that. We're going to do this, and we're going to do this. All right. There you are. Nice hit. Awesome. Ted and... Oh, what do we got here? Oh, we got a Remnants. Nice. Let's see what we got. Sabres. Sorry, not Remnants. Treasured Swatches. Paige Thompson. Had a down year this year, but I think Buffalo... It's slated to be a good team at some point. They can't keep being that bad, right? They can't keep being that bad. Anybody a Buffalo fan in here? Anybody a big Buffalo fan? 
They gotta be good at some point, right? The Utah Coyotes. <laughs> Out of 99, Brandon Hagel for Tampa Bay. He's a phenomenal young player as well. Brandon Hagel going out to Daniel. Nice hit. Two packs left to hit Bedard. Good luck, Ted. Good luck. And at 299, Trevor Zegris. Look at that, Ted. His second hit of the box, but without any Hawks. <laughs> Anaheim, at least. 299, Zegris. What team does Lynn have? Lynn has. Lynn has Coyotes. Coyotes, and then she's got uh, the uh, Hawks for the SP game used right there. <laughs> oh, Mike, that killed me. Mike says Buffalo isn't even a Buffalo fan. Hilarious. New Jersey, rookie redemption. I can look up who that is as well. Might as well look it up now so you guys know. Let's do it. Uh, 23, 24 artifacts. Rookie Redemption. I looked it up the other day to do our uh, our other thing, but uh, they were announced now. Which one is this? New Jersey is Red 218. If you guys are wondering what I'm looking at, there's a Beckett site that shows the uh, uh, list of rookies now. So 218. Oh, that's a big one. Simone Nemich. Simon Nemich. That is a big time rookie right there. A big, big rookie. D-man. 218 New Jersey Linden very nice the Utah Quakers is that what they're gonna be called is that what you're hearing that is a big-time rookie right there Simon Nimich nice all right that's a nice one all right we'll throw him in the back nonetheless nonetheless uh, if you're wondering Bedard is 207 on this list I don't know how well you guys can see this Bedard is 207 if you guys are curious uh, who the rookies are they announced these late because some don't play in the NHL till later in the year, and then they announce who the rookies are. Uh, the Roman numeral ones got announced. The first one is usually always the biggest player, so Bedard right there, Carlson, Fantilli, Cooley, Minchikov, Potra, etc. Cooley, Nice, Hughes. <laughs> yeah, I was waiting for somebody to say that. <laughs> Charge your phone. I was waiting for that. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Next box, 37. First box of the Series 2, Rob Craig, let's hit you, a Bedard. Why not? Well, why not a Bedard? We had four yesterday, none so far. Let's see what we got. Rob, good luck. We have not hit the uh, Bedard Young Gun out of this case yet. Uh, I looked, this will be box 6 and 7. So this will be box 6 and 7 out of a fresh case. There could be two Bedards in the case as well. All right, here we go. I'm going to move some of these hits to the side just so I can give myself a little bit more room. Series 2 is a lot of cards. So I'll give myself a little bit more of a play board here. Rob says, let's go. Rob, I think we got the Lava Hands going today. Look at all these boxes we've hit. All these three out of three different boxes, plus the Black Lustrous and the Gibson and Fantilli. I think this is a day for the, for the books here. <gasps> oh, I thought we had a high gloss. Okay, we don't have a high gloss, but we got something. We got a we got a young gun. I thought it was a high gloss. The colors were uh, were popping out at me. Clayton Keller, ecliptic. Hey, this is my sleeper pick, Clay Stevenson. At the time I made my review video, he was leading the AHL in all stats. I haven't checked recently, but uh, he is a beauty, Clay Stevenson, right there. Ecliptic, Clayton Keller, Arizona. Awesome, Rob, you're coming by Saturday. I am excited to see everyone. Rob, awesome. Make sure to say hi. I will be outside, so it'll be hard to miss me. I will be jumping around, doing uh, doing some content, giving them some prizes away. I'll have a table set up with, uh, with a QR code. It's basically just a QR code and some free base cards if anybody wants. Ecliptic, Jack Hughes, New Jersey Devils. Mark Giordano, Toronto. And Matt Murray, superstar. Yeah, I'm giving out a bunch of base cards to the kids. I mean, by all means, come by and grab some if you, uh, if you want as well. There's no age restriction. Hold your goalies. Yeah, hold your goalies in the Stevenson. Why don't I not have him up? Where is he going? We'll put him for Joe Colburn here. Joe Colburn can just poke out a little bit. Clay Stevenson going up. There you go. All right, let's see if we can hit our Bedard. Come on, baby. Dazzlers, Jamie Ben, and I just reversed these. Uno reverse. All right, there we go. Jamie Ben, Dazzlers, Panarin. San Jose Sharks, Ty Emerson, the best first name in the NHL. What do you think? Best first name in the NHL, Ty Emerson. 
Hilarious. 98 coming. Carrie's giving you some luck on the YouTube here, Rob. Good luck. Let's do it. Let's just hit the million dollar card. Could you imagine, Rob? Right now, million bucks. Columbus, Johnny Goudreau, Tyler Sagan, Deep Roots, Luke Evangelista, Nashville Predators. Going to our newbie after the nice auto. He's looking for more. A million bucks. That's US too, so about 1.4, almost 1.4 Canadian. Crazy. Trent Frederick, Boston Bruins, Brad Marchant, Deep Roots. Hey, there he is again. Askarov with a nice mustache there. Nice hit. Base in the back. I was trying to get merch done for this weekend. I wasn't able to. Ooh, nice gold here. These are hard to hit. Ryan Reeves, director of boards. Darcy Kemper. Damian Giroux. Mo Not Montreal. Minnesota. <laughs> Minnesota. Damian Giroux. Minnesota Wild. Young Guns there. Going out to Gary. Rob said he'd be good with it. Let's do it. That'd be fun. If not, somebody's got to hit it eventually in this group. It's, it's a matter of time. We open enough boxes. It's just a matter of time. All right, here we go. Sparkle PCs, Carlson. Valerie Nachushkin and Clayton Keller, Arizona, on the UD portraits. One of my favorite inserts of the year. Not of the product, of the year. Very cool card. And Carlson. There is a gritty. There is a gritty. It's pretty cool. Whoa, base card just flying right at us. All right, let's see what we can do. Cole Caulfield, Montreal, and Florida, Justin Sordiff, Florida Panthers. Did you guys get that feeling that that was going to be a Bedard? I got that feeling, but uh, apparently not. D Anze Kopitar. I got a weird feeling. I'm like, hey, could this be? Not quite. Not quite. We'll keep going. We'll keep going, Rob. Cole Caulfield, Ecliptic, Montreal. Monster season, Mick David, connected with teammate Leon Dreis, little for an assist. Jake Allen, distinctive, and Sam Bolduc, New York Islanders. All right. Pascal, I was going to ask you if you're still in here. Um, Schwartz Meat. That was the Schwartz Deli. I can't remember the official name. We like it so much. I might have mentioned this on a previous live stream. If you guys go to Montreal, check out Schwartz. They sell them at Costco, and we buy them all the time. And then you just boil it. It's pretty good. Instinctive, oh, Andre Vasilevsky. I don't know why that randomly popped in my head. Morgan Riley. Anaheim, Leo Carlson. Let's go, Ted. There you go. You are killing it today, Ted. Leo Carlson, Anaheim Ducks, Young Guns. That's the second guy we're looking for. Second on our list. Very nice hit. There you go, my friend. There you go. Best smoked wheat for Montreal. 1,000%. 1,000%. Ashton goes, oh, look, another duck. There is another one. We're playing duck, duck, goose in here. We know we got no gooses, though. Oh, look at this next card. Tanner you know, director of boards. Black and white. Canvas. Counter. Mick David. Edmonton Oilers going to Andrew. That is a cool card. Look at that. Talk about beginner's luck. Oh, 1,000%. 1,000%. Actually, actually crazy today. All right, we're going to put McDavid there for some good luck. Milos Kellerman, Arizona. Milos Kellerman. Rene and Angeli. Angelil used to own it. I don't know who that is. Should I know? Am I? Should I be dumb for not knowing? Yeah, honestly, probably. I don't know how many uh, OJ collectors there are, though. I don't think there's many. I would steer away. <laughs> All right, one more young gun. Let's do it. Come on. Oh, I thought we had a silver young gun, too. We do not. All right, let's do it. Come on, one more young gun. Rob. Uh, Ryan Shea, splashing a hole at the front. Silver, Brandon Sod, St. Louis Blues. All right, no Bedard, just the Ryan Shea. Pittsburgh, Ajo, and our Brandon Sod, St. Louis Blues. Going out to Amy. There you go. 
There you go. Celine Dion's hubby. Oh, no way. That's pretty cool, actually. Hey, you said no blues at all, almost midnight, and then the blues show up. That's some chat magic right there. That is chat magic. Uh, sorry, I just need to make sure there's no uh, cola or um, hawks in there. I don't think there was, but I'm just gonna I'm just gonna double check before we move on to the next box. I don't want to have uh, I don't want to miss a card here. Okay, perfect. All right, we're gonna go the other series two box now. Hopefully that SPG Muse stays there. Oh, nice. All right, we'll throw that there. All right, three boxes left. This is the second last chance at Bedard. 73. Celine Dion's hubby. Oh, everybody knew except for me. Jeez, I need to get up on my pop culture. I used to actually, uh, a while back, I used to open up a lot of pop culture boxes. If we get some more in, I'll definitely, uh, I'll definitely bring some in so we can do some breaks of it. It's super fun to do. You can hit like Dwayne The Rock Johnson autograph cards. Um, Robin Williams fabric card. Some, some really cool stuff that you can hit in the, uh, the pop culture. Ashton said, don't be dust. We gotta get these, I'm, I'm heating up the lava hands right now. We're heating them up. We're heating them up on the fire here. We're gonna get them real hot here. <laughs> Base card, time to sell. Time to sell immediately. All right, there you go, hot enough. This is Daniel's Hawks box right here. So good luck. Good luck, Daniel. Hawks box, we're hoping we hit Bedard. If we don't hit Bedard here, that means we have five boxes left in the case. And I, I'm not going to jinx it, but uh, there's good odds the next ones will have the Bedard. Igor Shesterkin, Instinctive Sparkle, Darlene, and Walker Duar, Calgary Flames. These next Bedard Bonanzas, they've been filling quick already. They might fill even quicker now. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Ecliptic, Jared McCann. I mean, there's sometimes there's two uh, young guns in a box, so or in a case. Uh, it's very possible. There's you usually get about one and a half to two Bedards, and a lot of the cases we open had two Bedards. Jared McCann, Columbus, Tyler Angle, and Jake Livingston on your UD canvas, young guns. UD canvas, young guns. Nashville, both our newbies having a fantastic day here on the cards. Congrats, newbies. Tyler Angle, Columbus. It's crazy that uh, we say beginner's luck, but it's actually it actually really does happen. It's wild. People don't believe it sometimes. I go, good luck, first timers. Always hit, and they don't believe me, and the hockey card gods hear everything. They hear everything. All right, let's do it. Oilers, Leon, Dry Settle PCs, Deep Roots, Yossi, J-Rob, Portraits. J Rob and Leon Drysaddle. How many people do we have on Facebook watching? My thing froze. Can somebody let me know? I'm kind of curious. We got 31 people on YouTube. If you're on YouTube right now, all you have to do is subscribe, like this video, and there's a Bedard going to come up in this box. But you have to do that. You got to click subscribe and you have to like the video. That's the only way we're going to hit a Bedard. If somebody does it right now, I guarantee there's going to be a Bedard in here. Tyson Forster, Dazzlers. Arbor, Jack Guy, and Hugh McKing. St. Louis Blues. And we went from no St. Louis to two St. Louis back-to-back -back boxes. Nice hit. Arbor, Jack Guy there. Arbor, Jack Guy. <laughs> Pasco said he's on both. All right, Pasco. You better, you better subscribe like a million more times. Jody, all right, sweet. Like it. Comment, who's my favorite player of all time or currently? Because Wayne Simmons, one of my favorite players. Claude Giroux. Um, I really like Bobby Clark. Um, who else do I like? Zach Hyman's my favorite current player, though. Hey, highlighters. That's a nice one. It's the, uh, I mean, they're still rare, but this is the least rare out of the bunch, but still a nice card. David Pashnak, and look at that color match. Unbeatable. Unbeatable with that color match. Mike says he's found the Bedard Young Gun likes to stick with the Boston guys. All right, well, let's find out. We saw him with Uvis quite often, but uh, instinctive Philip Grubauer. Well, look at that. Another duck. Duck, 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 duck. There's been no goose. Tristan Luno for Anaheim. Another one. Highlighters, Boston Bruins. The nice color match there. We'll throw it in the back because it's probably going to be really easy to see. There you go. Base. 
Andrew's on Facebook, so I'm listening to his. Doesn't sound good to have two going at the same time. Yeah, I think I think uh, my mom usually watches on Facebook and YouTube uh, when she's when she's tuning in, and she'll just mute one of them and then watch on the other. It's it's. I do watch my own breaks sometimes just to see if there's anything I can improve on and rewatch big hits. I love it just as much as we all do, um, and I'll usually put it on my TV. Actually, I have uh, the smart TV with YouTube, so. Uh, it, it, it's definitely interesting seeing it on that big of a screen. Tage Thompson, Buffalo, Dry Settle, Deep Roots, and Jacob Peltier, Calgary Flames. Peltier, Calgary Flames. Yeah, it's not even just newbie luck. Everybody, everybody hits big cards. Yeah, I have a, uh, I don't know if I have it out here. I used to have in the back screen of my breaks was a, uh, uh, like, I'm not joking you, almost like a half life size Wayne Simmons uh, figurine. It was pretty cool. Anyways. It was really cheap, too. Easy to look for the candy cane by your left thumb on the young gun, LOL. That is true. That is true. I try to hide the young guns as much as possible, but sometimes they poke out. Tate Johnson, Ecliptic! Michael Kesselring, Arizona. Coyotes. Utah Grizzlies. I don't know what they would call the team. The Utah Ice Skaters. That's probably what they would call them. Who knows? <laughs> All right, Adrian Kempe, LA Kings. There you are. Of course, best content on YouTube for breaks. Pasco, you're too nice. You're too nice. <laughs> Better to watch YouTube on the big TV and chat on Facebook. Hey, that's a good point, actually. That's uh, that's what I think uh, a lot of people that I've talked to, a lot of friends that pop in, say that's the best way. Put it up on the TV, and then you chat with your phone on the Facebook. Or you have a different YouTube account for the... Uh, for the chatting, it works out pretty well. PC, Speckle, Zegris, Barabinov, Devin Levi. That's one of the goalies we're after. Him, Askarov, Wolf, some of the top goalies in this year. So, like I say, hold on to those goalies. 16, Doug, thanks. I just saw that. I don't know why that just popped up for me. 16, thanks, Doug. PC's McDavid, Karis Litting. John Beecher. Well, if Mike is right, we might be seeing Bedard here. He said he likes to hang out with the Boston Young Guns. Here we go. Here we go. Ted's doing the same. You guys, you guys got it down to a science here. I like it. Hoping for Bedard for mom. Let's do it. Let's do it. Yeah, Lynn's got uh, Lynn's got Bedard for the next box. She's got the Hawks. But we're putting all our energy right now. Into Daniel for a nice young gun. Here we go, Daniel. Glaring Alex Ovechkin. That's a cool card. I like these. They're hard to hit, too. Glaring. Konechny Flyers and Marco Casper. Detroit. Glaring Alex Ovechkin. Two packs left. Come on, Daniel. Come on, Daniel. Instinctive Alex Georgiev. Nashville, Luke Evangelista, Fluorescence Red, and Simon Edvinson, Superstar. All right, final pack, Daniel. These Bedard Bonanzas, I'm gonna, we might as well do another one. I have, I think, I think it's five boxes left in this case. There's gonna be a Bedard somewhere in there. Maybe even two more. Oh, I keep thinking we get the Silver Outburst Young Gun. All right, we do have a Young Gun, though. Come on, Daniel, last chance. Here we go. Three, two, Jari, instinctive, one. It is Lucas Condada, Montreal. No Bedard today, at least in this box. We got one more. And your silver outburst, Jeff Skinner, looking like he's about to take that on the lip. Jeff Skinner, silver outburst. All right. I was hoping for that last pack we have, Jonathan. You're right. Hoping for that last pack magic. Didn't come through. All right, let's see if we can try our luck with the Bedard one last time. 73. This is... Also, do we have any Hawks hit? I don't think we had any Hawks hits in the in any of those uh, Bedard boxes today. We gave the Hawks away for free. Yesterday, we had multiple Hawks hits plus four Bedards. This one, no Bedards. What's going on? Let's see if we can hit one in the final box. SP, <laughs> SP Game Yuchi. I like that. S Gucci. SP Gucci. I don't know how to say that. Uh, oh! 
Do you have your memberships out? Because if you don't, grab your Thick Boy memberships. We got one. All right, here we go. Thick Boys, Thick Boys, Thick Boys only. 9 out of 118. Noah Dobson and Joel Teasdale. Authentic rookies. Dobson. I think he had Chris Kreider from behind the other day. I heard people saying that Rempe was coming for him. I have yet to see that. But uh, Dobson, great player there. One out of 118. To the bottom, Nino Niederreiter. Our newbie hitting again. Newbies are crushing it today. Spagucci. Yeah. Oh, that's great. Ashton, That's. I'm going to start calling it that now. Spagucci. We're going to open some Spagucci. All right, Kevin Korchinski. All right, we got one Bedard. At least. I mean, one uh, Hawk at least. Kevin Korchinski, great player, honestly. N uh, a very good consolation prize. He's going to be uh, one of the D-men of the future for uh, the Hawks, that's for sure. Offensive defenseman. He had uh, over 70 points in his uh, last WHL uh, season. All right, Lynn, that is yours. You had the Hawks for that one. Put that right there for now. Actually, you know what? We'll put it right there for now. Whoa, where's that going? Oh, I see what's happening. Huh, it'll stay there. All right. Islanders. Jersey Brock Nelson. Islanders. Going to Aaron. Going out to Aaron. Brock Nelson. Okay, come on. Chance Epidard here. Come on, hockey card gods. Ooh, that's not a good sign for Bedard. All right, definitely not Bedard. Let's see what else we got, though. Come on, this San Jose. Catch premium out of 25. That is now your lowest numbered hit. Metal Legends really, uh, really uh, jumps in for the lowest numbered hit. But nice hit, San Jose. Go to Riley. Mario Ferrero. And you have the jersey from Ferrero as well from the uh, Stadium Series, I believe. Global Series, Czech Republic. Nice hit. Your patch, three color, blue, black, white. Nice one there. All right. Final box. I think the, the podium is locked in at the moment. Can this change up the podium? Wouldn't it be nice to hit this guy right here? Yager, Sackick, Brett Hall. That'd be nice. Wouldn't it be nice? Wouldn't it be nice if we could hit a Bedard? Wouldn't it be nice if we could hit a one of one? Everybody loves my singing. It's so good. That's honestly what I'm known for. Lava hands, thick boys, and uh, fantastic uh, Os or uh, Emmy. Wait, no. What is the what is the singing one? Not Emmys and Oscars. That's movies, TVs. Somebody will know. Anyways, some sort of singing award. <laughs> All right, we will go. I don't even know who to open for. We'll just go. We usually just go front to back. I just see if we had a one on one. Hey, that's not bad. Theo Fleury, Calgary Flames. Ryan, nice hit. Seven of eight. Now the lowest numbered hit. Seven of eight. Theo Fleury, one of the most unique autographs. It almost looks like two germs fighting or uh, two Pac-Men going at each other. Very interesting autograph. <laughs> Pasco said, uh, the audience going down by each note. That is true. I probably lost a couple subscribers there. Grammys! Andrew, thank you. Andrew, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oldie here. We have Dennis Hall Exotic. That's looking like the, the snake skin there. Whoa. And that is four of four, Chicago. Dennis Hall, that's going to be going to Aaron. He's got the Hawks for every other box. Nice hit, Aaron. Dennis Hall, four of four. And we got one more card to go. I uh, most likely will not have a break tomorrow. I'm gearing up for Saturday. But I will have either a big break Saturday or Sunday to celebrate National Hockey Card Day. So make sure you are looking out for that. All right. Here we go. Edmonton Idol. I'll try out. i got to try out. Canada's Got Talent should be coming through. Ice. Isolated. Cracked ice. 
It is Solming Toronto. That is a great ending to a great break. R.I.P. One of one Toronto. Nice hit, Doug. That is awesome. That is sweet. Toronto Maple Leafs. Solming is fantastic. Nice one there. Bore. Solming. That is cool. One of one. All right. Let's see how the podium shakes out. Thank you, everybody. Yeah, Leafs hold. Leafs hold. Thanks, everybody, for watching. What an end to the break. That was awesome. Hey, I sang. I sang for the one of one. Hockey card gods heard me. All right, let's show off the podium. I think we're going to do a few on this one today. I'm feeling generous. Let's go with the gold. Peter Forsberg and Bore Salming. One of one. Silver, of course, has to be Yager. And our bronze. Newbie with the Askarov and our Dennis Hall. Your Chicago Blackhawks. What a display. What a day of cards. You may or may not see me tomorrow. I think there'll be no cards tomorrow as I gear up for National Hockey Card Day. But I will be announcing tomorrow what is going to go on on Saturday. So you can choose to come on Saturday or not. I would highly recommend coming. Shout out to all of you for jumping in today, for watching, for supporting. We are up over 1,600 members on Facebook. That is unbelievable and over a thousand on youtube you guys are all amazing we're gonna give back this weekend for national hockey card day we will see you soon and for those watching ufc 300 i will be watching if you want to know my picks hit me up because i am ready all right have a great night everyone and we will see you very soon make sure to say hi to me on saturday and win some free stuff till next time everyone you know how it is peace out.